Hello you guys, welcome back to Ironclad RC. Got the Sonic Wake out here at the Park Pond. All right, we're gonna be uh, working on tuning this boat today, okay? Uh, we've got an upgraded motor in this boat, a 4074 SSS motor, fly color 150. Uh, and, and I've been, uh, I've been, running the boat but I haven't really started tuning the boat okay so we're gonna start tuning the boat in this video uh, basically just messing with the trim tabs on the boat um, we're gonna go from one extreme to another all right we're gonna start off in a neutral position then we're gonna go extreme up extreme down and then fill the boat out and kind of go from there with it kind of get the boat tuned in and uh, see what it'll do on 6s all right I've got my dynamite GPS here. Uh, I have a link in the description for this. I just finished up greasing the boat, my pre-run grease. I used dynamite marine grease, so uh, check the description for that. I'll also be running this 642 in on the boat. All right, uh, that propeller. It's small. You get long run times with the boat with a smaller propeller. So uh, we're going to use this propeller to kind of get the boat tuned in. Like I said, we'll go one one extreme to another, and that's how I like to tune my boats. That's how I like to tune them. Kind of see what the boat does when it running dry. See what it does when it's wet, and then go from there. All right, so stick around. Oh, that was clean. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we need to do. Let's see what we need to do here. So, uh, going from one extreme to another here, you guys. I'm going from one extreme to another on purpose. On purpose. All right, so this is where the trim tabs up, like, uh, okay. So this is up, basically higher than, higher than the bottom of the boat. All right, I'm going from one extreme to another on purpose, on purpose, okay. This is how I tune my boats, okay. So going, so my my trim tabs are up higher than the bottom of the boat right now all right let's go from one extreme to another extreme all right let's fill this boat out all right i got him way down there okay i hope you guys can see that i got him way down there all right i had him all the way up above the bottom of the boat just now so let's see what this extreme does okay so that's keeping the damn bow down So the, actually, the, the extreme to me is actually what this boat likes. <laughs> okay, all right, so, so uh, we'll kind of go from here with it, all right? So just kind of, when you get your new boat, you know, and you're trying to tune it, you know, I, I guess the best way to do it is what I like to do, is go from one extreme to another extreme. Get it to run real dry, and then get it to run wet, and then see what, what suits the boat best. So let's get us around in here. All right, so it kind of stayed down, but she seemed like she was skipping. All right, so so it actually seemed like it was running good. All right, so let's go down with the right one just a hair more, okay? it's To me, this is an extreme on a boat, but it seems like this boat's liking, liking the, the extreme down trim. 
all right so it slowed the boat down but it's it's in the water okay so we're gonna find its g-spot <laughs> all right so let's get us a run here all right so that actually did pretty good Let's watch it again. It's not torque rolling like it was before. Okay, just going from one extreme to another. Okay, so she seems like she's wanting to stay down, but she, she's bouncing. I'm gonna go down with the right one just the freaking hair okay that's a lot of trim that's a lot of trim but I'm, I'm just feeling it out she's holding down she's wanting to bounce a little bit so that's telling me I got too much trim and I may need to um, I may to start doing some need to start doing some stinger adjustments 53 all right so that's the best speed I've gotten so far with this boat 53 miles an hour all right all right let's see what it does with some down trim all right let's see what it does with some down trim Nice. Uh-oh. Something let loose. Man, I was just starting to get the boat tuned in, you guys. Jeez. Yep, that's what it is. Yep. Yep, see all that smoke coming out? That's not from the motor or ESC. That's from the collet. I'm pretty sure this collet's notorious for for doing exactly what you've seen happen it, what it does is just kind of gets uh stripped out you know loosened up in there and you lose um damn that prop sharp and you lose grip on the cable i actually soldered the end of this cable so uh, i don't know why it's losing grip there All right, so uh, the cable actually looks good, okay? We'll maybe dip it in some solder again, kind of build it up a little bit where the collet has spun on it and kind of wore it down. But it uh, should be salvageable, all right? Um, I guess we'll have to change the collet out, okay? I had noticed it was kind of, um, when I would tighten it up, that it would actually uh, bottom out on each other right there. I've noticed that here lately. So um, I'm pretty sure that's a common a common thing with these collets on this Sonic Wake. They eventually need to be uh, changed out and upgraded. So uh, we'll get that taken care of and get back out here, man. Um, 53, 53 with the boats, not too bad, not too bad. Uh, I know it's got a lot more in it. Like I said earlier, I'm just kind of getting into the boat. Uh, as you guys have seen, um, I've already, you know, I changed the big block and everything, put a big block in it. So I'm basically starting from scratch with my tuning. And um, what I like to do, like I said, I like to start, you know, from, uh, from scratch. I'll go all the way up with the trim tabs, go down, just to kind of feel the boat out. That's how I do it. Other people may be different, but um, we eventually need to get the trim tabs adjusters on these uh, trim tabs so we can keep them, 
keep them where they're supposed to be at. The new V2, the new V2 Sonic Wake is freaking cool, man. They just come out with it, so check it out. It should be on the channel here shortly. Um, they come with the trim tab adjusters already on the boat. So, uh, yeah, man, yeah, we'll uh, we'll take a look at the new V2. We'll get this one back out here. I've got my uh, 50C Spectrum packs and the 100C packs. So um, we'll be able to do some more running. All right, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Big B with Ironclad RC, channel where we tinker, test, and tune everything RC. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I hope my, my tinkering helps you guys out. hope it helps you tune your boats. So ring the bell for future videos, future builds, future projects.